I'm Sharon, and this is Dan, and we're with RaiseGardens.com, home of Rivers Company. Dan is really the head of this operation, and he got me started with the raised beds. And I'm going to put one together, an octagonal raised bed, and he is going to go back to his gardening. See you later. So the octagonal raised bed is this right over here. It's made of incense cedar, very rot resistant. It's two tiers high, 11 inches high, and it's two by two, about 24 inches in width. And it's secured with aluminum pins, rust resistant. So now we're gonna start making the bed. We start with four pieces, and we put them at the opposite ends with short side up, short side up, and the same thing on the other. I might have to bring these in just a little bit. There we go. Short side up, short side up. Then I take the next four right here, and now I insert them with the notches, making sure the notches match is very simple. Right? Now I go with the long side up and I take an aluminum pin and I put it down matching hole and notch. There we go. And I do the same thing on the other side. Take my next piece long side up, short side down. It's like a puzzle. Match the notches, insert the pin. Match the notch, insert the pin. The octagonal shape is eight sides. Very easy to assemble. And notice I'm not using any tools. Just match the notch and the hole. Kind of have to look down in here. And there we go. And the last one for this tier, this layer. Match the notch and the hole. notch and the hole. There we go. Now we got our first layer. Now we take the next eight pieces. This raised garden bed has 16 pieces. Now we're going to start the second layer. And we'll keep it, we'll do it the same way. Short side and short side. So we'll start with that, match my holes, push down, I skip one, and same thing, short side, short side. Again, I skip and go to the opposite side, short side, short side. Same thing here. There we go. Now the last piece of this layer, next part, long side, long side. Now we just fill in. Holes, push it down, match the holes, 
and push it down. And there we've got our octagonal raised bed. Same thing as here. And if you find that this octagonal, octagonal shape is too wide or something, you actually can change the shape of these, of these beds. So you can move it where you can make them rectangular in shape if you need to. Or you could also make it in a different shape even this kind of shape if you want to. So there's multiple shapes that you can design with this bed. If you're interested, please visit us at raisegardens.com.